Hello and welcome to this quick tips video which is about bounce selection which allows you to turn multiple audio files into a single audio file. So this is an updated version of the video because I had some uh, comments about the previous one that I put out and there's actually a much better way to do it. So this is uh, thanks to the people who commented on that. So bounce selection, if you didn't know, what you can do, you can highlight multiple audio files, shift and right click or two finger tap and then do bounce selection and then that will replace. But the issue with it is that it only does it to the extent of the files that you've got. So for instance, here, you can see if we zoom in on this, this kick drum doesn't extend far enough. So then if we repeated it, even if we'd done it with this, we'd end up with these odd sized parts, which is very easy to end up with something that doesn't work too well. So the way to get around that is to use the range selection tool. So click on the range selection tool, make sure you've got snap turned on and you're on something sensible. So in this case, I'll be in bars. So I'm just going to click from there, bar one, beat one, up to bar five. And I'm going to extend that over there. So I've selected all of these. And now same thing, shift, right click, bounce selection, replace events. And there you go, perfectly sized bounces. And away you go. Now you can just duplicate these as normal because they are just normal parts and they're all as you can see here they're all the right length hopefully you found that useful and if you have please like and subscribe and we'll see you again soon for more music tech tuition